real quick. And all right. Okay. All right, guys. It's time for the Overwatch Minute. And Greg, you have to wait for a second because there's a cool intro for you. Uh, all right. Here you go. Let me know when. Here you go. You're over watching me with Greg Deeds. Okay. Hello, everybody. Um, so for the Overwatch Minute, um, uh, it, it's 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 not a huge busy week, but there has been a couple changes to the game. Uh, first and foremost, if you're looking to get Overwatch away skins, because right now you can only get Overwatch League skins for the each of the um teams and you can't get away skins which are basically just white with a, a brief color of what they are um so uh so i'm watching a um i'm watching an o nickel match right now because i'm trying to figure out the thing about lunar colony because lunar colony has a change on the ptr so um. pardon me if i'm kind of in and out but yeah you can get the new skins um uh, one of the doors on the Lunar Colony has been closed off, and I don't know which one. Oh, that one, really? Okay. We're, getting, we're getting some live reporting on the scene. <laughs> I meant to watch the video earlier, so I just kind of fucking forgot. Um, anyway, um, okay, let me go to my list. Do, 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 do. Okay, so uh, Hanzo has had a big, big change. Um, as, I've, as I've talked about before, they wanted to take away the Scatter Arrow and give him uh, a volley of arrows. And um, uh, is it the live video? My video? Yeah, I'm gonna try some. All right, go for it. All right. <laughs> I'm trying to do fancy um, stuff, but things are breaking. You're not ready. You're not ready. <laughs> uh, anyway, his volley of arrows is called Storm Arrow. And it's, um, it's basically like, um, I'd say about five seconds of an ability, but he can fire six fully, um, drawn back arrows, uh, in, in that, in that a lot of time. So let's say there's multiple targets and you want to kind of share your targets and not just like, fup, 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 fup. it's like, he can go like, fup, 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 fup. like he can do that or fup, 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 and then kind of move and then fup, fup, fup. like as long as it's within that timer. Um, and that is on an eight second cooldown. Um, so he can get some like some wicked headshots, but no longer bouncing fucking a whole quiver on the ground and killing you in one shot. Um, the other ability they gave him is a dash. So he can like jump left and right or forward and back. Like he could jump out, fup, 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 and then jump back um, or walk out and do it and then jump back behind like a shield or something. Um, so giving him some more mobility. Uh, but other than that, he's not changed at all. Um, everything else works exactly the same, even his alt. Um, but there have been some hero changes as of late. And I will bring those up right now, if I can remember where I put them. Sorry, guys, give me one second. Here we go. Okay, so, um, Lucio, his wall ride, he can now wall ride on a single surface, even around corners without being interrupted. I saw, um, I saw a video of this online. That is dumb. <laughs> he basically can like wall ride the entire time and not touch the ground. It's insane. This actually is not a bad thing, considering that Sombra is a hard counter to him now. Um, if Sombra hacks Lucio, it turns off everything. True. He can't wall True. ride, he can't heal, he can't speed boost, nothing. He can just shoot. So, you know what? I'm okay with that. Um, also, his uh, the sound wave thing, the boop, his boop ability, yeah. is uh, it no longer consumes ammo. So, if you have 20 rounds, the boop would take three. Now, it takes nothing. Mm, 
Gotcha. Um, Tracer's Pulse Bomb. Her max damage has been decreased from 400 to 300. This was a problem they saw in, in the Overwatch League where um, it was too good at killing tanks, which is not its intended purpose. <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. So... <laughs> Uh, Junkrat, his uh, frag launcher, the projectile size decreased from 0.3 to 0.2. So, you know, huge difference. Not really at all. And the rip tire uh, movement speed has decreased from 13 to 12. So really nothing's changed by him. But I will say this, my opinion about him right now is he's too overpowered, uh, especially with two landmines. But people figured out that if you dive with, loose, with, with Junkrat, he can do an ass ton of damage to a tank. Because... He can throw bombs without getting damaged. Hmm. And so he'll dive into tanks and dump all six rounds into a tank and then die on top of the tank or just throw a landmine and kill the tank immediately. Like, it's 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 nonsense. His entire kit is built to um, push tanks back and take out shields. That's his whole kit's purpose. And right now he's able to just dive fucking uh, <clears throat> Orisa or Reinhardt and kill him very quickly. So it's just... I would rather them give the ability back to him that his my, his uh, bombs hurt him. That'd be great, but whatever. Um, uh, let's see. Uh, where was it? Genji's deflect. The hitbox size has been reduced. So oh, um, yeah. yeah, heard about that. So you have to be more uh, precise with your with your deflect now. <laughs> Get um. You're no kidding. <laughs> and uh, Brigitte's shield bash. Her the cone of of effectiveness has been reduced from ninety to sixty. Mm, wow. Yeah. Wow. So like people would try to get up to her left, she she'd shield bash and hit him, and they were like, I wasn't even near her. So now she'll now it's more in in a spot. So, um, but yeah, those are all the hero changes. Uh, let me go back to my list here. Uh, oh, uh, one more and one more thing. One more thing. The um, Retribution dropship. So if you've played the Retribution map, um, which by the way, the new map is in the PTR and apparently it's a little broken, but that's the whole point of it being in the PTR. Um, people would not get on the dropship at the end. So it would, it would <laughs> yeah. oh yeah, it would end and then just like, all four players have to be on the dropship to, to end the match. And one player would just be out there still fighting an endless wave of uh, increasingly stronger enemies and then die. And then if they full on die, game over. So there was an update that came out where that it changed that. And now um, if that person dies, they, they die. And if there's somebody on the dropship, it ends. It just gives them less XP. Mm, cool. So... Other than that, the Overwatch League is going strong. Uh, a lot of fun to watch. Um, and I'm looking forward to more uh, content from them. Awesome. But yeah, guys, that is it for your Overwatch Minute. All right, that's your Overwatch Minute with Greg Dietz. All right, so. Okay. Um, I actually need to 